When you're originating traffic from a remote or untrusted environment, it's required that you use multi-factor authentication to do so. Now, the PCI DSS does not really call out what technology you can or you cannot use. What it effectively says, though, is that you need to use something you have, something you know, something you are. One of the things that I would caution you against is NIST just came out with some guidance around using uh, SMS messaging, text messaging, for multi-factor authentication, and that was actually deprecated. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if in the near future, the council doesn't come out with some guidance on that as well. Now understand that this multi-factor authentication is just not required for you. It's required for all remote access. So if you have a vendor, if you have an employees, if you have administration staff coming into your environment from remote, they're required to use two-factor or multi-factor authentication in order to do so.